Hello and welcome back to another episode of Aliens A Dark Descent. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the blind playthrough of Legendary Difficulty uh, with Iron Man. And I am trying to somewhat save as many colonists as possible from Dark Hills. As far as I'm concerned, uh, we have not been really successful with that. Uh, last mission or last episode uh, showed a lot of them just blatantly dying. If my recollection serves me well, we have uh, so far rescued two, but we have lost a lot. At least four or five. Well, things are not uh, looking so good, but what is looking good is our surveillance system here. We know exactly where the aliens are. Move on. That gives us a huge advantage. Redeploy the squad. We want to go over there. Believe me, we're still in easy aggression. Uh, over time, the aggression of the hive increases. And boy, oh boy, uh, it's not going uh, to be fun. You've uh, seen the la in the last mission kind of how how um, an onslaught looks like but uh, when I played uh, pre-played uh, to this uh, blind playthrough oh my gosh once you are in aggression territory dozens of these guys are going to come every single uh, time So I'm thinking, how about uh, a couple of uh, things. Number one, deploying, motion tracker. deploying this in order to kind of block, block it a bit. And secondly, deploying sentry gun. Tracker deployed. Deploy the sentry gun. That way we do have a full kill zone. Sentry gun sentry plus our uh, plus our ARC. That should be good enough. Alright, off we go. Yeah, that does not count against the aggression because it's not us killing them. On it. Let's see what's inside. Some more ammunition. Move on. Oh, and a data pad, of course. Hey, I found something. Looks like a data pad. Move, move. See what's in there. Let's uh, take a look at the terminal. Nothing so far. This is not going. Uh, this is not feeling well. This game is in a unique option to just create a horror. I already know that something is going to go wrong soon. I don't know yet what. Blood everywhere. Come on, team. Wow. Why do we need to go Hurry that up, deep blood. into into corridor? Wonderful. The aliens certainly made this here their home. It's quiet. Too quiet. Uh, let me just double check something. I think what we haven't done yet is deploying motion tracker. Place the nice little Sending motion tracker motion here. Tracker. Motion tracker deployed. Hmm. 
But there is a barrier. I don't want to waste ammunition if we can just move around it. Double time. Move on. You got something on a tracker. Right now. Ammunition and recover the data pad. Hey, I found something. Looks like a data pad. We got plenty of ammo. That's not too bad, actually. Here's your container, Administrator. Hey, we have to be sure. Go check it. There's only six. No, eight ants here. And no nest. Not nearly enough to invest a whole company. They must have another way to breed. You know what, Hayes? I don't want to hear about it. Check the container's log, Marines. Let's see where that crate came from. Access granted. Come on, team! Okay, just want to make sure that we can use that way if needed. Uh, what? The squad is about to encounter a difficult threat. Heal your squad, reduce marine stress. Okay, that is done. And gather enough supplies to overcome the menace. Okay. Hmm. I have multiple signals. Roger. Hey, I found something. Looks like a data pad. Not much here, Sarge. Only a signature from Gallagher, colony director. <laughs> No. Oh, what? Is that a Pratt alien? There's something around. Good. Are you running, guys? How about here overloading that a little bit of a distress got something on a track okay that big alien is moving slower come on team infinite onslaught mm. Lost an armor there. Flare and suppress a fire. Big alien coming. Incoming. Shit. You saw the size of that thing? Tell me it didn't come from those cows again. We should head to the director's office. But maybe we'll find more about the container there. Good call, administrator. You reckon the Gallagher? Sent the containers to Pioneer Station. There's only one way to find out. You need a ride, squad. Don't forget I'm here. Good. We do we do have a lot of uh, stress and increased move on. Increased Xeno activity. So 
So what are we going to do? We need to de-stress first. Standard location there. We're slowly but surely running out of tools. There is some more tools up here. I think we should move to here. And the biggest problem is we now need to go to uh, Sergeant Gallagher's uh, office, which is the second floor. Massive onslaught, infinite onslaught has entered the sector. Oh yeah, I, Hurry up, that's what I was talking or referring to. Come on, team. This is a problem. Very soon this will toggle down. Uh, I assume they could maybe come come from here. Suppressive fire. Good, where is that infinite onslaught? Can't find them yet. They are closing in. That can mean a lot of things. We're now on the brink to medium aggression. There we go. Let there be light. Seems like they're coming down. The hive has launched a hunt. No, we don't want that. Uh, reload the sentry gun first and then we're picking it up and we definitely need to reduce stress. Pick up sentry gun. Redeploy to here. Ooh, okay, lots of dead aliens. We lost some ammunition. The hunt, I think, means that they are checking your last position. So kind of repositioning is helpful. didn't want to be spotted and you can see once you're engaging in fights things are escalating very very quickly for instance right here we got a reload Stay frosty, Marines. we got disobedient around. for every two disobedient Marines maximum command points reduce well that door then we got uh, web here with disruptive or marines in the squad in, including take additional stress damage okay so let's rest shake off all of those bad feelings with rest uh, we should also see a substantial reduction in, bed. in their craziness oh the game is saving I see
Good. Uh, you can see there is a residual level of stress uh, still here. So, I don't know, can we rest again? Come on, team! No, potentially not. Um, okay, whilst we're here, let's plan our next move. There are still some tools up here, which I think we should be taking. There was stuff here which we haven't taken. So let's make our way, take the tools, move back down and get to the higher level, second floor. That's where we not need to go next. Got something on a track. I wonder if we should uh, just put our sentry gun right up here. Cut that door open. Breaking the well. Or if we need it for the next uh, onslaught. Door clear. Might Come use on, it for team. the next onslaught. Hurry up, you slugs. New alien spawned here. There are two tools and I would feel that we would be doing a disservice if we're not at least trying to go for the tools but there are three aliens and more will be spawning soon. can see medium uh, level aggression definitely means more, more aliens are coming around. This guy is currently killed by the ARC, which is good. These guys up here, however, are left unchecked. I really would love to get uh, the tools. The one disappeared, so... Let's do a run for it. There's something around. No, no, no. Problem. Got something on a track. And we got one guy coming from here as well. Come on, team. Hurry up, you slugs. There's something around. All right, let's move in. Okay, that's a problem. More signals incoming. Quiet. It didn't see us. Drone spotted. We're spotted. Bring them down. Good job, guys. Good. We More don't. Uh, we don't want to launch Careful. anything here. Good, that was unsuccessful. More signals incoming. Copy. Don't move, gonna fix you up the best I can. Here you go. Good as new. They're headed our way. Good, whilst well, they're distracted. Let's Take go to the second floor. Watch that stress, squad. We could de-stress up here. Hurry up, 
squad. On the bright side, no aliens inside. Come on, team. On my way. Got something on a track. Motion tracker. motion tracker deployed. Setting up motion tracker. Motion tracker deployed. Okay, do we have anything else here? There's potential loot. Could be a tool. Move on. It was ammunition, but that's okay. There's something around. Yeah, aliens are beginning to move up again. Right now. Let's see what's inside. Xenotech blueprint found. Kevlar plate. Uh, okay. Don't get too comfy, okay? There's no one there, Sergeant. Patch me in. I'm sure we'll find something on his personal terminal. Let's see what's inside. All right, let's see what's in there. Okay. All right. Wow, the story is intense. It's encrypted. Can't you open it? The way you security standards are simple but strict. I need his access codes, and as a company executive, the director has an obligation to carry them with him no matter what. But I don't read Gallagher's PDT anywhere near us. Then I guess the trail went cold. Lucky for us, we have more objectives to complete anyway. Stay sharp, squad. There's something around. Team. Hurry up, squad. Good distraction. All of the aliens are running to the north. That's good. Got something on a track. That gives us enough time to call the elevator and get the hell out of here. On it. First floor, thank you. Ooh. Come on, team. Move, move. Okay, so extract your squad to the vehicle, primary objectives, but there are still primary objectives done. Okay, we could go to the mine shaft, but we don't have a job for that. House stress level, I think we're taking a short breezer. Signals incoming. Weld that door. You shall not pass, fuckers. Good. We could go up here and just check hold. downstairs because we've seen people being just pulled downstairs. So I guess that could work. Could go through here and check the rest. Let's start over here, check the rest, get these question marks, go up here and go down the mining shaft. How about that?
Deploying motion tracker. Setting a motion tracker. More signals incoming. Motion tracker deployed. All right, rest. Ooh. I had a couple of injuries, but other than that, clean mission. What are you waiting for? Breakfast in bed? Move on. Cut that door open. Break the weld. And we're going to leave the tools here. Door open. Hurry up, squad. Am I trying to do that again? I don't know, if we really need tools, we know where to find them. For now, let's redeploy. Good, we still got plenty of ammunition. And we got our sentry gun, if need be. What has served us very well uh, so far is just putting up motion trackers everywhere. And by the way, <laughs> within uh, almost one and a half hours of playing this game, we haven't yet even reached kind of a hard, uh, the hard levels, the aggression level. I distinctly remember that I reached it within 15 minutes and then got overrun. Move on. But we're close hurry to it, so gotta hurry a bit. Uh, what we can do here is be true to our principles setting of setting up motion trackers. Motion tracker activated. All right, There's nothing here. Uh, we can get that and that, They're and I think. Away. That's pretty much all we get. Ammunition and nothing. Okay. Come on, team. Hurry up. Good. We're redeploying all the way up here. That's blocked. Oh, that's blocked. Well, hmm, maybe we really need to extract now. But maybe I've been missing something. I want to get all of uh, the, I want to do the full mission. If we already fail on the first one, that's not a good sign. Not really sure if we played this well. But let's take let's take stock, okay? We can't get up there because it's blocked. Hence not going into the mine shaft. That is the mine. Second floor, nothing. Down to first floor, this one here is broken. It's quiet. Too With quiet. no more objectives. Well, I guess we extract the squad. Um, you will you will be able to continue this mission on future deployments. Oh, okay. Well, in that case. Pfft. Alright, if we can come back then that makes the game definitely a bit easier. Just need to make sure that we're not losing our marines. But I have seen something uh, in the game uh, settings about the doom clock, so 
I would guess it is not that easy. So we have done 70%, which I would say is average for a mission. Well, yeah, okay, it is what it is. Uh, by the way, we're going to name uh, these guys. No trauma, slightly wounded. But we can promote, oh, we can promote you. Common attribute available. Um, this squad generates 5% more retribution points, dead eye. Marines uh, disembedment chances are increased by 13%. Or the Marine has one more health. Um, well, health is not bad. But insta kill is good as well. Let's go with that. Cool. There seem to be other upgrades that I can't yet. Ah, you go to the barracks. Okay. Hardened. Maximum armor. Increase Marines' maximum bravery. Reduces the stress experienced from any source. Well, that's not, that's not bad. Um, removes the Marines' negative trait. Where the bravery is reduced by 2 per aggression level. I might as well just take that. Because here, we, we would also reduce stress experience. Okay, well, there you go. You're no longer a coward. Sharpshooter increases Marine's accuracy. That sounds good. Bravery and stress reduction, that's good as well. And health. Um, Let's go with better shooting, I suppose. I like the reduction in stress, but I also like killing Xenos quicker. Uh, removes negative trait. Detection time is reduced by 10%. Oh, no, no, no. Not so good. The squad earns 10% more materials. That's, that's good. Grants X to the hack interaction option. Uh, I think we're going to go for the looter perk. I don't know what smart ass is going to allow us to do. I am concerned that hacking doors might cost us uh, tools and I don't want that. So let's go with more loot. We rescued an engineer, that's good. And we uh, got another recruit. And we got chitin uh, uh, Kevlar plates. one crusher and 47 drones okay cool so hostile critters or wiped out colony Hunslet being Hunslet how'd you find your first day in the core I don't know it's a lot to take in but it helps you're doing okay thank you I'm glad it's over my nerves are shot oh it ain't never over but for now, we got some time. Good. Gives me a chance to work on the comms. If only we could hear from Director Price and Pharaoh Spire. We could use her help. Dr. Becker's been trying the whole time we were deployed. It turns out most long-range transmitters are down. If someone's home at Pharaoh's, they probably can't pick up. Do you think those things can be there too? Judging by what happened on Pioneer, 
It's clear that they're spreading extremely fast. Then you'd better get familiar with the Otago right now. We can't give those creatures the benefit of time. Available Marines 7, Tired Marines 4, Wounded Marines 4. Available weapon purchases. Okay, wow. Yeah, well, let's start with the laboratory. Ah, Administrator. I wanted to... Oh, going that badly, isn't it? I'll get back to you on that. Can I do something for you? Actually, yes. I was hoping you might persuade Sergeant Harper to retrieve some samples of the creatures. One can never have too much information about one's enemies. I didn't know you worked in corporate espionage, Doctor. <laughs> Very droll. On the other hand, I do find that science and skullduggery have a surprising overlap. Both require focus and a keen eye for detail. One supposes. True enough. And you're right. We need more information on these things. I'll talk to the sergeant. Chief Engineer Corrigan, isn't it? We met before. Oh, it's you. Sorry about that, I... You had your hands full. Things look better now. They are. Came together faster than I thought. Ain't pretty, but we're functional and, I hope, stable. Harper told me we got splashed after some kind of failure in the planetary quarantine protocol. Something called Cerberus? That's what's going around, certainly. More corporate corner cutting. What a fucking mess. Anyway, I should be able to produce equipment for our Marines now. Anything I can do to help? Well, I don't think this ship will ever be spaceworthy again. But that doesn't mean we have to abandon her. It could be shelter, you know? For these people. For us. The only problem is dear Otago took a beating. I got holes to patch, cables to reconnect. Our cryo chambers, our shield, their history. In short, we're missing materials. Spare parts to turn into upgrades for both our guys and the ship. Look, no promises, but we could ask the Marines to check for materials in Dead Hill storehouses during their next visit. It all helps. Good, we got 123. Um, and we could either go for an incinerator unit unlocks the good old flamethrower or a mine hmm I like mines but I also like flamethrowers a lot uh, let's start with the mines though curious to see how sure they are doing special weapon special weapon means we can get them with um, our command points so not only can we place motion detector sensors for uh, decoys and distraction but we can also place a couple of mines. That's not bad. I like it. Let's double check the medical quarters. We got two physicians. This one's a priority. Understood. Huh. All right, these guys are tired, so I can't can't bring them Hello, back. Administrator Hayes. Administrator Hayes, what brings you to my corner of the Otago? Sergeant Harper says I should take a look around. He's probably trying to keep me busy. Yeah, the devil loves idle hands. I can't give you a tour. We're still digging through the wreckage. How does it look? Well, we've more portable weapons than we've got Marines to carry. So if you find anyone out there with training, you point them in my direction. As for the ordnance, it's pretty much scrag. What about the emergency escape vehicles? <laughs> that satellite relay idea of yours, huh? Yeah, Harper told me. If we can get the fuel linkages repaired, we might salvage one EEB. But I'd be damned before I let you play with the only life pod we have left. And how useful is a single life pod on a crashed ship exactly? Yeah, you're pretty convincing. I'll give you that. All right, take it. But keep me updated.
Did I teach you, Marine? Salute. All right, and I noticed my microphone was muted. So uh, all I uh, said uh, was we are uh, we've selected a couple of upgrades, and I wanted to draft a few viewers. So let's meet the team. Natalia Ray uh, has uh, rejoined uh, for uh, being one of uh, the most active commenter uh, commentators on the channel. Charles Morrell, aka the Fiddler, uh, has joined us. Uh, Xenotaph would be joining us as well, uh, Zoe for uh, being an active uh, commenter as well. Then we got good old uh, Brian Cracks aka Afterburner, <coughs> Preston Wasp aka Waspinator. Tony Lopez aka Rombar, Daniel Asander aka The Dubinator. Uh, John Calabro, uh, you didn't give me a call sign, so I figured John Rambo could be good. We got uh, Jacob Bertelsen, aka King Joby, and uh, finally Brian Craggs, aka DOG. Um, I did my best with the limited customization that is available. Uh, more important or more interesting though, uh, we have these upgrades, but they individually cost um, material so not only do the weapon the actual weapon upgrades cost material but also the individual soldier upgrades cost material this one won't let you down so how can I so all of them are just normal Marines and the higher level ones are in the med bay. Okay. To be discovered, something else. Uh, we can't build anything. Medical quarters, I think we're pretty much uh, through. And off we go to the deck. Back from your tour? How'd it go? Pretty good, I think. Dr. Becker requested some samples of the creatures for study, and Chief Corrigan is in need of components to turn this ship into a proper base. I thought you were all about getting your message out. There's nothing to say we can't do the one so long as it doesn't endanger the other, is there? True enough. All right. Let's go back to Dead Hills. I have a feeling we missed something there. The same feeling you have when these creatures come around, Sergeant? This is hardly the moment. 
Deputy Administrator. Listen, Sergeant Harper. Your abilities, they could be tied to this outbreak. If there are more like you out there, it could help. People should know. They have the right to you know. You mind your own business, Hayes, and I'll take care of mine. You have a relay to find and I have men to lead. We both have a part to play. This conversation is over. <laughs> Can't launch a mission. A day must pass before a new deployment is available. That's enough for today. Select next day uh, and confirm your choice. New objectives are awaiting your review. Old ship uh, cemetery distress signal. We received a distress signal from a shipwreck and an old ship cemetery. Lose deployment. But rescue an engineer or ignore it. Hmm. I don't know how important the days are, guys, and I don't know what an engineer can or cannot do. But going by XCOM standards engineers are important. One new engineer have been added to the Otago. Okay, what does that do to us? This one's a priority. Understood. Have a nice day, Deputy. Wait, wait, wait. We do have something new here. Codex. Okay, that just explains what we're doing. But what does an engineer do? Well, apparently produces produces material. Have a nice day, administrator. Yeah, we lost the day and I still don't know what engineers are doing. I can only speculate that they might create more material. Welcome, Administrator Hayes. Have a nice day, Administrator. New objectives are awaiting your review. Nervous breakdown. Zoe suffers from a nervous breakdown. Order her to rest. What does exhausted mean? This one won't let you down. Cannot be selected to participate in a mission. Hmm. Damn it, Zoe. Why did you have a nervous breakdown? Okay, now the age old question do we want to get the level 2 soldiers further into the missions or do we pick new soldiers? kind of to rotate I think we're just going with a high level team for now and pick one additional soldier we, we created 20 material I have the feeling that materials are very valuable so we don't want to just I waste them Salute. We could give uh, Natalia pouches, that would be great, or better accuracy for aiming. Oh, they do have, all of them do have the same, the same um, upgrades. I tell you what, let's, Pouches aren't bad either. Hmm. 
that allow for more medical supplies and more tools. For each marine with this attribute, uh, the maximum capacity increases by one. Uh, that's not bad, but on the other hand, this here makes ammo so much better, and this here makes just aiming better. All right, going with bigger clip size. We'll keep 30 material because we can't do anything with it anyways. And we'll try to keep it from there. We have no Xeno samples, <coughs> but we do have engineers. Oh, here, each engineer generates five material per day. Well, it's not bad. You can count on them, man. Good. I tell you what, we're going to do. Um, wait, wait, wait. Planet infestation process with each passing day. Each time planet infestation uh, gorge reaches a new threshold, the overall difficulty of all locations will increase. Oh. Mm, okay. That is not good. Okay. This looks like a good, um, a good cliffhanger. We're going to go to Dead Hills in the next uh, iteration with a couple of properly equipped and ready Marines. So I hope we can rock and roll it. Thanks for watching, guys. If you don't like the aliens uh, and, and uh, want to pay back, make sure that you are smashing that like button. A shotgun or a uh, plasma grenade would be the right way to go about it. Thanks and have a good one. Bye bye.